Alright, it is not pretty out here today. I recommend everybody to stay inside and enjoy a nice warm living room and watch TV or something because it is not pretty out here. It's raining, windy. We're going to give it a try. I had to get out. I haven't been to the beach now in over a week or so. And so, I had to give it a try, right? I have not very, got very good reports from all my friends that come out here either. So, we'll see how we go. Stay tuned. <music> Well, as you can see, we don't have to worry about social distancing at the beach today. I want to see a couple people down here. And the ocean is angry today. Well, if you don't need to do anything else, you get to see the beach and get out here on it with me. If we don't even find anything. So I'm not I'm not having a lot of hope today. I'm not feeling it, that's for sure. Alright, let's get down here and see what we can do. Alright, I had to let you see this beach down here. There's nobody on it. And it is just waves coming in everywhere look at it rough it's rough hate to be out there that day this is the inlet i show you every now and then calm down the inlet a little bit but you get down there it ain't calm at all a little cool today Woo. go from 80 degrees one day to 50s the next i tell you never know the weather's doing my area i tell you that all right let's see if we find anything well here. i got my first target i think it's gonna be a quarter i'm not positive yet it's a weird number it rang up. Like a 30, but that one is 36 or something. I'm assuming that's a quarter. Yeah, that's a quarter. It's just a weird number it came up. Usually they aren't that dirty, but that one's got some serious corrosion on it. Alright, well, got a quarter right off the bat. I'm happy with that. Alright, check these pelicans coming right at me. That's cool, they're gonna fly right over my head. Awesome! Good job, pelicans. I love it. I love catching them in flight there. Alright, let's keep getting out here we go. That's cool. Alright, we're fighting the wind and the waves. Trying to get a target here. Oh, I got a target. Uh-oh. I got many targets all in here. That's for sure. I think that's going to be a penny probably, but right now we'll take any target. Oh my goodness, here we go. Woo! There it is! Pin in the basket! Y'all can see it in there. Let's get up here and dry and get out because it's, it's pretty cold out here and I tell you what, I don't want to get my hands wet today. There it is. And a little sand pillow. Check him out. Alright, he's gone. Alright, let's get back down here in the water. I'm hoping that the whoa. Is that a target or my scoop? That's my scoop. Sometimes you get the scoop close up to your detector gets a little hit there. Alright, let's get down back down here in the water. Let's see what we get right here where the water's coming in at. Sometimes this is where we want to be at. Get deep deep here. Not gonna go too deep today, but get down here where other people don't want to go. Try to get some targets here. Alright. A little bit slow today, I'm going to tell you, I, I got a feeling it's going to be a little bit slow. But, uh, whew. It is definitely cool out here today. Alright, well stay tuned, we'll keep getting up, see what we can find. There we go. Alright, it's not many targets out here. 13, 14. 14. I like a 14. If you can't get it. We don't want the water to take it away from us, so you gotta be careful about that. The water will definitely steal your target, buddy. Right? I say it's still in there. I checked just to make sure, but I think it went just a little bit deeper, actually. It got right on top of it. Alright, let's see if we got that time. I think we got that time. Let's get up here. Whoa, I dropped some. And it's in what I dropped right at the top of my scoop. Uh oh. See if I can't scoop it up again. I think we got it that time. Came right off the top. Okay, let's get down here. Yeah, it's not real loud. Uh oh. Here it is. A little small piece. It's not in my ears, but not a very big piece sure and I think that's it right there look at that 
Probably a little piece of jewelry. Looks like a half of a circle like little thing right there. And it's gone. Wind just blew it out of my hand. There it is right there. All right, we'll bag it up. All right, one thing we don't like about this area is that right there, if y'all see it right there, that's a dredge pipe. That pumps sand from the inlet out onto the beach. It completely covers the beach with uh, fresh sand here. And it does pack in a lot of sand. It ain't got anything in it, but the other side end of the beach also has, has sand pumped in from the sh offshore. So we got a lot of sand replenishment in the area, which is covering up a lot of stuff. We had to take a good storm to take a lot of this out to get it exposed again. But uh, yeah, you never know. That's why we're here. I just keep might actually have another coin down here, which I believe we do. I think it's a nickel. We'll take it. I believe it is anyway. All right, let's bag it up. I can't believe it. Another quarter, another coin. You know we're gonna dig that one. That's right in the gold area, right there. Ah, all right, let's see what we got. Here. I can't believe we got it, but maybe we did. Maybe we did. We did. A lot of little tiny. Brass piece. I have dug some brass too. I see it down there. I'm not sure what it is yet. Oh, all right. I'm not sure what that's from. Probably some kind of ammunition on the beach here. All right, a little gig tip, and I talked about it on the in the fields and on the beach. When you get one hit, check around the area really well. Because normally. Like on the beach, a lot of people drop multiple chains. Or in the field, it might be a trading area. It could be anything. So uh, you always check mo uh, really good in the area that you get a target. Especially when you haven't been getting anything. Then you get a target. you got to really check that area. All right, let's check it out here. I think we're at... Uh-oh. Here yeah, we got the water coming in. I just kind of hold my feet over it to keep from taking it back out. Telling you, that water will steal your target in a heartbeat. I'm not sure where it is. Let's see if I can dig it up here and get out of this water area. I didn't get it. Right, let's see what we got here. Right, no, oh, there it is. I see it. It's a pop top. All right, let's keep digging. Get this signal down here, and I think I see something in my scoop. See that right there? I don't know what it is yet. But I got a feel this is it. And I think that's where it was. A fishing fishing lure. Where's the hook on it? Alright, let's bag it up. Man, that was a hard one to get to. Dug it twice. Got a signal one time, I give up. Went back again, got another signal. Saw that string hanging out of the basket. So that's gotta be it. And we got it. Alright, just keep getting up. Alright, just took a scoop out and look. I see a string uh, thing here. Oh, whoa, let me get some out of here. I'll take my detector away. It looks like we might have something anyway. Hold tight. I'm getting there. I gotta get all my stuff. I'm at the water. But I see a cross. All right, hold on. Here we go. Let's get up here on dry sand. Woo! And it is a cross. Man, I'm happy to see that. It might just be stainless steel or something. I don't know yet. Just a regular type of chain on it but we did find something anyway I like it looking good all right let's keep digging here we go all right that's a wrap on this beach man the wind and the cold Woo. anyway I do have two more beaches I want to hit real quick I mean real quick uh, the one that I get my buttons from, you know, I got a, a Revolution War button there, and some Civil War buttons, all kind of stuff. Uh, I want to hit that, and one other beach that a friend of mine got the gold at. So let's hit those two real quick, and we're out of here. Stay tuned. Oh, we made the beach too. First target, 25. I would have to say a dime if I had to guess, but. Oh, it's not a dime. It looks like it could be a ring. Holy smoke. We got a ring. I can't believe it. Holy smoke. That could be sterling too. Some kind of ring. It's got to be a ring. 
Man, let's clean the inside over there. Oh, I see something in there. What does it say? I'm trying to read it. It's got a number in it or something. I don't know. Sweet, though. We got us a ring. I can't read the number in it. But it's got some kind of writing in it. So it's definitely not too much of a junk ring. Worst case scenario. We might have us a... Yeah, it might be stainless steel, but... 11. I can't read good. 925, baby! Sterling silver! We got a sterling silver ring. Awesome. First target on Beach 2. All right, let's bag it up. All right, I think I have found my little honey hole, my hot spot. Dirty right here again. Man, I can't believe it. Yep, there it is. Another quarter right there. Check it out. Man, here's a little honey hole here. This little area. Silver ring, two quarters, and a dime. I just dug a dime right and recorded. But getting a few targets here. We do have the horses out running out here today. I don't see anybody behind him, though. Poop or scooper. There he is down there. He's coming, though. <laughs> Have a good one. All right, that's beautiful, aren't they? Horses are beautiful. Pretty animal. All right, let's get back to digging. All right, we did pretty good at beach number two. I'll take that all day long. Uh, we haven't been here 30 minutes, so we're going to head on to beach number three and call it a day. Stay tuned. Here we go. All right, this could be our only and last dig on beach three. Very weak in here, but we are in the uh, in, in token territory. Now, we've got a pretty decent hit. It's deep one, though. I think. No, it's out, whatever it is. That's not going to be a token. And there it is. It's a penny. All right, we'll take it, though. It's a coin. All right, let's get home and see. Look at everything. See what we got. Pretty sure that's a stolen silver ring, but we got to get on this microscope and check it out. All right, here we go. Well, we did a lot better today than I thought we were going to do. We got some silver. I'm going to show you that in just a minute, but I'll tell you a quick story. Uh, my friend, uh, Jimmy Dillon, found a gold ring down there this week, and nobody's been finding anything, but I'll put a picture over here right here. Check it out. Uh, 10 carat, full of diamonds. Check it out, man's ring, full of diamonds. Uh, over 100 some diamonds, I'm sure, in that thing. But anyway, it's a pretty looking ring. Anything 10 carat, any gold is pretty, right? Anything yellow. Show me the yellow. Anyway, uh, other people have sent me some um, pictures of what they've been finding. It's been nothing. I mean, just nothing at all, Harley. So I'm really happy with what we got today in a little short time we were down here. All right, let's check it out right now. All right, here we go. We got, of course, we did dig some trash. And just little tiny, tiny piece. You saw me digging some of this little tiny stuff down there. I got Corona again. Oh my God, am I in trouble? I did get two more Coronas. I got some secret and something else too. We did get a little over a dollar in clay, which is pretty good. Not bad for this time of year right now, uh, especially what everybody's been finding. And we did get two pieces of jewelry. One sterling silver ring. Check it out, I put a picture of it, 925, baby. I like it. Any sterling or gold. We want that's what two things we look for. Sterling and gold right there, baby. This I'm um, just thinking it's probably um probably stainless steel or something. I don't see any markings on it as far as um being a, a precious metal. But it's a nice it looks nice and um you know somebody I know will probably want to wear it, so we'll can't save that for give it away to somebody. But anyway, uh we did pretty good there. I like it. It was super Super windy down there and cold. Actually, it was pretty chilly down there, but um, could have been better. Could have been some sun. I like to see the sun and that one. We can't wait for the warmth to come out while we can get in that water. I, I, I can't wait. Trust me, we're going to be hitting some good spots this summer in the water for sure. Me and Buddy going to be wearing the snooper rig out and hitting some good sights. You know, sometimes just neck deep, blue overhead maybe, but nothing super deep. But we're going to be finding some good stuff. I guarantee it. Anyway, I appreciate everybody coming along on this adventure. Don't forget to click like, comment below, share, and subscribe to the Gig Master. All right, thanks for coming along.